Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Naya Slivers. Ooh, I like this hand. I can dig it. We'll keep. Uh, I think we're gonna lead with the Sidewinder still. Or, uh, well, we're gonna see what they're playing, so I guess we'll just figure it out once we see what they're up against here. What do you got for me? Blue. Ooh. Preordain. Okay. Uh, maybe I will get down the Viverlint now, then. It might be better. Get some early poisonous. Okay, I don't want any more islands. Uh, I don't want any more mana, though. Not islands. <laughs> okay. Comes in tapped, so that gives us a second. So I think we'll try to lord it up here. They have something to counter this? They got four spike. Oh, that's that's ugly. Now you got me on that one. Got me on that one. Splashing black? You are splashing black. Alright. I see you. Now I would just really like to draw creatures from here on out. <clears throat> Give me a gem hide. Sure. Sure, they say. Gonna let me attack in. There we go. But will you take him out? You will. You're gonna do something. Black, blue. Okay. Not a great start for us now. The hands seem fine, but then we flooded. And we got four spiked. And they're just passing. We get a hunter. Oh, wow. Well, that's that's cool, huh? Sure, we'll try to put down a hunter. It's all we can do. Ping it for one. <clears throat> Brainstorming. Pass with the counter spell up. What you gonna do? Pass with the counter spell up. Okay. Need the stampede. Boy, I'd love to play you right now. Let's see if we can get them to do anything with their uh, their mana here on the attack. I need this refill badly, so I don't want to play into a counter spell here. I have to wait for them to tap out or do something else. We are just flooding like crazy. Well, you know, we're hitting them for three every turn. It's a slow clock, but it's a clock. We have them at 12. And they're not doing anything. Tragic lesson. All right. Mm. 
Gonna return to land? Okay. You got anything to play? Alright, paint a black. For what, though? Gurmog? Gurmag? Gurmogan? I hope not. It's a Gurmog. Lovely. The preordained with the counterspell backup. Okay, well, to lead the Stampedes, let's see what we can do. Counter one, I'll play another. And I, if I hit some stuff, I should be able to get some creatures down at least. So I'm not attacking in. Sure, it deprived me. like this. Go empty-handed to refill. What do you have? Wow, we found trash. Well, Bladeback can still actually do some work, uh, I suppose. So, let's put both these down. Okay, we are a Hellbent, so we can at least start hitting them for five every turn, just like they can. We're beating them in the race, though, for that. As long as they leave my blade back alone, which it looks like they're going to kill right now. Oh, okay. Uh, I, would, I would say go for the blade back, but sure. And there it is. Okay. And they paid for life for that. <laughs> yeah, that's about right. Oh, they for didn't attack. Why didn't you attack? Oh, well, that was silly. Want to counter my gem hide? I would have attacked. They couldn't have died next turn. They're just playing patient. There's a chance we can recover from this, but it's... It's gonna be hard. It's gonna be very hard. What are you going to find with Augur? Another snuff out. Okay. Is that an instant? It is. Well. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. It's not great. He, we just play this, he dies, basically? I don't know. It, it's rough. Still can't really attack into this. Our muscle's probably gonna die. Unless they're just trying to be extra careful with their life. They could go full mana snuff out right now, I suppose. Another auger. We need a winding way. I think that'll save us here. 
Ugh. That's pretty bad, though. I don't like that. Don't like the echoing decay. Let's see if this resolves. Yay, nay? It's not that hard of a choice. Wow. Let me put it down. Hmm. Do I attack in here? Clear the board a little bit? Uh, they'll eat one of my creatures with the Gurmog, but I don't care at this point. Let's provoke you. Oop. Provoke you. And yeah, we'll provoke you. And we'll provoke the Gurmog with the Hunter. At this point, I don't I don't need that anymore, so... And we'll say you, I guess. I don't, it doesn't really matter. Maybe we'll break the game. Uh, yeah. We're gonna use everybody's ability. Sure. That's our best bet of winning, is breaking the game. <laughs> There's the snuff out. Paying the four life for it. So now they're free to block with that. Sure, sure, sure. Okay. We'll trade off some augers here. One of our creatures will get eaten. But they're at four life. Now maybe we can just try to go wide for a turn. They got an echoing decay still, so they can echoing decay something. It's not being gonna be a great target, but <clears throat> it is what it is. <clears throat> Sure. <clears throat> Forest. Wow. That's great. Let's see what they want to do here. Sure. Our top decks have not been good so far. Pretty unfortunate. Another Gurmog. That's unfortunate. <clears throat> so now they should be able to start attacking in, I would think. No, not gonna still. Okay. Another gem hide. Pass. so frustrating when you're this close to killing them 
you just can't get the right top decks. And they're holding up counter spells every turn. A third Gurmog. You feel ready to attack in yet? <laughs> No, wow. Sorry, they're playing so slow. Well, let's see if this will land. Probably not. Sure. Two cards in hand. Three Gurmogs out. Can we beat three Gurmogs? We're 16 minutes in. They're running their clock pretty hard. Hey, they're attacking. Look at that. Finally. Pass it back to them. They're probably going to draw some more cards here. This almost seems like that's what they were setting up for. Yep. More tragic lessons. <clears throat> Cycle. Sure. Oh, that lead the stampede is not going to hit, will it? Need one other spell to try to get that going. Give me like a juicy target. Give me a lord that they can counter. Then I'll slam this lead the stampede. All right, that's good. Counter my winding way. Counter spell. Sure. Counter my lead the stampede. Don't you dare. You mother trucker. Alright. Well. Ah, we'll go. We'll try to do one more top deck, I suppose. Down to one card in hand. Start chump blocking a little bit, I suppose, but. Yep. Chum block one, we'll go to two. Delver just to, to rub it all in. Alright. On to game two. That game was way too long. Uh so we can do Pyro. Relic. Take out a lead, take a blade, take out Hunter. Hunter usually isn't that good in this matchup. Striking two. Sure. Let's run it. Let's run it. Wait for them to sideboard everything that they need, I suppose.
What would you guys think of yesterday's popper video? Did you enjoy it? If you did, make sure to leave a comment. Let me know if I should continue playing the deck. I had fun with it. I know it's not going to win, like, a lot of games. In all honesty, I think popper format is just, like, two turns too fast for us to get the mill majority of the time. But it is fun to play, and it does feel good to, to mill when it happens. But let me know if you want to want to see me keep playing it. We will play first. We can keep this hand. It is decent. Hopefully we don't get force spiked again when I try to play a lord. Maybe we'll just play a Viverlint for that very reason. Play around it. Want to be mana efficient though. We'll see what happens. If we draw a land, then I think I'll play Viverlint to play. Oh, you know what? This works. I'm I'm fine with this. They want to force spike a sidewinder. They can. Black's good, as long as they're not holding up Counterspell right now. Doesn't mean they don't have other things, but... Augur's good too, we can attack into that. Let's see what it's going to find them. Nothing? Oh man, they had a bust. Oh, okay, that's good for us. It's very good for us. Alright, let's uh, throw down a Lord. Start go, go, going. Well, they busted with Augur. So, maybe we can get a board going here. Love to be able to hold a Pyroblast. Bring in a Mystic Sanctuary tapped. They got it. They probably have a counter spell in their hand, and they need to get that double mana going. Ash Barons. Well, I think we're gonna do that still. I'm gonna grab the mountain. Let's still try to play out a Lord this turn. But then we'll have the Pyroblast back up for when we Winding Way next turn. Four Spike? Echoing Decay. Okay. I can live with that. We're putting down a new one, so this is fine. Alright. We're looking good. Of course, we did have them at four last time, and they were able to come back, so. Tap in the blue. Okay. You got an extra island sitting in your hand? Interesting. Well, let's go to combat first, see what they're trying to do. If they tap out for something we can Pyroblast, cool, uh, then we can still Winding Way. Hopefully it's the negative. Yeah, it's Agni Warp, which is great. It's a good target for Pyroblast, in my opinion. And now they can choose to block or take six. They are going to block. And then we get to refill. Creature, please. I'll take it. Double Lord. 
If one gets countered, another one's coming. Delver. Sure. And a blade back. Okay. Doing anything with my muscle? Are you going to take out my sinew? Nah, we're going to go to game three. All right, cool. Uh, I'm good with throwing in this back. Let's do it. Some longer games this week. <clears throat> Alright, give me another fast start like that, please. But now we're on the draw, which is a little worse for us. Come on, dude. Let's do this thing. Good hand, good hand. Like this. Uh, no, can't keep this. That sucks. Don't like mulliganing. Uh, we can keep this though. Dump our blade back. It's just so slow though. This is like what we had the first game, wasn't it? Lost Wing Sands, Ash Barons, and then they could just take care of everything we had. Let's see if they mulligan. They do. So that's that's good. Oh, that's nice. Let's get our mana right right now. Grab a forest. Uh, I think we're just going to play around f for Spike and stuff. If they want to kill Viverlin, sure. Let's remain unthreatening. Going to kill him immediately. Now nah, they're gonna. Okay, they're brainstorming. Alright. <laughs> they got their double blue. Oh, that's unfortunate. Chainer's Edict. Hate it. Hate it. Now we can get a lord down. That's nice. Let's do it like that. Beautiful. Just need to keep drawing into creatures at this point. And hopefully they don't have a lot of interaction for our board. They're brainstorming, they're preordaining a lot. 
which tells me they're trying to reset their hand a little bit from their mulligan. So I want to keep my board very low. Winding way. Hmm. So I'm going to wait to play anything till I can play both of these. Let's just swing and see what they do. If they tap out for something, I'll, I'll winding way end a turn. Or my second main. So they're going to agony warp. Sure. Play around four spike. Creature. Well, we get double lord. One will probably get countered and we could drop down the other one, I suppose. Oh, uh, what are you going to get back? Agony Warp. That's unfortunate. Goes to the top of their deck. Yeah, that's, that's unfortunate. Gonna counter? Deprive. I'll well, we'll see if this lands. Well, it does, but it's gonna get agony warped. They're gonna run out of time. We're gonna time them out. Snuff out. Okay. I'll still get in there for one. This is a good deck. This is a good control deck right here. Good Delver. I like the addition of the snuff out. I think it uh, works for them pretty nicely. Anything you can just play without actually using your mana is pretty dang good. Ugh. It's annoying. Let's see, can we go Hellbent? Or are you gonna counter? Well, let us go Hellbent a little bit. <laughs> or not. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. They're doing it. I'm not gonna let them time out. I'll, I'll concede if they just show that they can do nothing. Unless I pull into a lead the Stampede or something here and they can't do anything about it. They're digging though. They're playing well. Sidewinder. Well, I could do more damage just swinging with blade back this turn, so. Maybe they're finally out of stuff to do. But if they slam a Gurmog anytime here, it's going to be pretty bad. Alright, bust. Another Agony Warp. Oh my gosh, dude. That's crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Okay, well, let's pass the turn. We'll just ping him for two. Agony warp now. I'm going to hit you for two for a minute, you know. I 
It is what it is. Uh, we get a muscle. Will it resolve? No. That is a quick counter spell if I've ever seen one. Terramorphic Expanse. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, oh, give me my refills, please. That's not a refill. Look, I'm not trying to time you out, guy, all right? I just know I have outs to swing this game. You have two cards left in hand. I get one good play, and I don't think you'll be able to compete. I mean, at least start swinging in for a little bit of damage, I suppose. One damage. <laughs> Sure. You block one, you take one. We get it. It's all I can do. I bet you they're digging for that Gurmog. <clears throat> Brainstorm. Viverlint, let me have it. How do you keep doing it? The churning and burning is real. It's so ridiculous. We're both playing fast. It's just like, ah, oh, man. Answers for everything. It's ridiculous. And here comes Agony Warp again. Oh my gosh. I only got a minute 30 left. Like, this is ridiculous. I kill off one of my creatures here. Probably my flanking would be his best bet. Oh, he's going to do. Wow, that. And then Agony. Oh, no. He's going to save the Agony Warp, I guess. All oh, right, Agony Warp's coming now. My bad. Kill my lord. I already know it's dead. It's okay. <laughs> I'm just trying to keep your hand low. Let's go. Where is my refills? Just give me a refill, please. Oh my gosh, this is not a refill. Sorry, man. I, I you know, I can't concede these games where I can do stuff. All right, give it to me, please. Let me have it. There we go. Give me something good. All right. All right. Hold on. Cancel. Let's go. Gem hide. Plated. Predatory. Predatory is still going to die, I think, right? Pretty sure. Yep. Could still swing in here. Even if it dies, well, we could still get in for a little bit of damage. Oh, does he not? Is he not going to play the Agni Warp? Alright. Might have been able to scoop this up right in the last 30 seconds, potentially. Let's see. I can still Agni Warp something. Alright, they gave up. Uh, we had another Lord coming. Uh, so even if they took out our Predatory, we drop another Lord, we swing in for lethal. Uh, we just purge them of all their, their cards until their hand was empty. Pretty annoying. Pretty, pretty tedious game. 
So that's a that's a long one. That's a that's a long game. Uh, hopefully it was enjoyable to watch. <laughs> hopefully it wasn't too bad. <laughs> uh, you know, I never know if these gameplays when they go 40 minutes long. It's like holy cow, man. Like could have, could I have played faster? Could I have conceded earlier? That's like my biggest thing is like. Should I just have conceded earlier? I don't know. Like, I have outs in my deck to swing the game. You know, at some point, I can't do anything, but if I know I have outs, I have outs. Like, I'm not going to just concede if I know I have ways to win. That's kind of how it was in the third game, too. It's like, I'm... Like, you're you're countering, you're killing all my stuff for days and days and days and days and days. But I know all it takes is one turn for you to be empty and no counter spells, and then I have a winding way, and then the game's just swung. Uh, so it's interesting, but hey, if you uh, if you're if you're subbed uh, or if you're not subbed and you made it this far, thank you for watching. You're a champion, and uh, if you're not subbed, please subscribe uh, for more Naya slivers and more gameplay. Uh, leave a like on the video. Make sure to leave a comment below. Let me know you guys are making it to the end of these 40-minute videos, uh, <laughs> and we will see you guys in the next one.